So what do we do? I'm not a big fan of the energy orb. Uh, yeah, and it's fun. Do you know if the endless mode rewards you at all? Because part of the reason why I'm holding off on it is because there's some endgame guns I'd like to get my hands on. So do we do, do a Heavy Blaster? Oh, which has a 20% crit chance. But I gotta look at something. Where's the, where's the crit modifier? Crit chance times three. Oh, geez. So if we get a purple Goliath EM, that's like a times four or even more. We'll see. Let's see, did I get some sleep? Yeah, I did. Uh, I did get some sleep. I'm, I'm feeling much better today. You know. Do we go for this? Double say need any uh need I say more. I've tried double saws before. It's uh shockingly not great. Do we grab the pressure booster? I mean, I'd be able to fly with it. Not immediately, I'd have to buy one connector first. What else do we have? No, pressure booster wouldn't be as good as like a power circuit. 50% extra damage might actually make the, um... Might actually make it work. Cause yeah, this is too expensive. Yeah, th this should work. Hope we get a better... All right, soldier. This is the final shield ship. Don't waste time. Everyone here wants a piece of that mother gunship. Except me. I want nothing to do with it. Well, you're not real. I mean, you are, but you aren't. Thanks. The real people can't wait to get on board that ship. Right, I died on this one. Ooh, that threat level nine. Scary. The one problem is the uh, heavy blaster has got kind of low velocity here, but whatever. Uh, I've got some nice coverage regardless, and the heavy blaster does crazy damage. So I'll call it close enough. I think I'll go back to the rapid blaster after this one. I just figured this would be a good idea. Ooh, that was an ouch right from the get-go. I mean, I guess what I could do is actually switch it up and put the, uh... Eh, whatever. Okay, so I got no money for that. Because yeah, it would be would be great to get this power circuit instead of the one I came with. But we Doctor, have no money. We know the mother gunship is the heart of the fleet, but what does that actually mean? We theorize that it's like a processing center, a brain. Captive earthlings are cataloged and stored in a thousand different library ships. But the mother gunship acts like a server. Destroy it, and in theory, you destroy the fleet's ability to draw from its learned data. A shot size add-on would be a perfect fit for this game. Yeah, it would be. Okay, so main problem I'm running into here. I do not have a whole lot of shot speed. But that's okay. Where are you? There he is. I got him. Okay. Because I do a decent amount of damage. All I have to do is just hit and run him. Problem is, he hurts. Yeah, we're gonna have to take the really boring approach for fighting this guy. We're starting to hit some of the upper echelons of challenge here. So, some of the later levels are gonna be a little bit on the harmful side. 
Also, these door locks are just jerks. Well, that's okay. I was kind of hoping what, uh, the further you got into the game, the levels would get longer, not, not more damaging. Oh, you're still alive. Because one of the one of the problems I'm running into is just uh, like that guy hurts real bad. Let's see, are the red bolts crits? Yes, they are. Wait, definitely, definitely not a dead end. Oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, I was hoping we get longer levels and like bosses and stuff, but like it it feels like they've mostly just been cranking up the numbers. The further you can go in, which, I mean, isn't the end of the world, but, uh, I don't know. I was just hoping by the end of this we'd have a, a couple of, like, runs that are as If you destroy long, the mother gunship, then all the connections to that hub vanish, right? Like, all the minion AIs, the smaller ships. That's the theory. It means the alien ships can't do, well, anything. Like, respond to our fighters. Good. Then I can do my job and save the planet. Can it, Hylas? You're not saving the planet on my watch. Uh... Well, whatever. I mean, it's not gonna be that big of a deal. I just gotta be very careful here. Stay away from the buzz saws. And we'll be okay. Oops. Oh, that's a bad place to be. You don't want to get stuck down below near all of those guys. Whoa. I can kind of just keep these guys off with pure raw gunfire. And the f once I once I take out the uh, the saw blades, we are golden. I just gotta stay away from the incoming fire. Okay, there we go. Huh? I think the saw the. The buzzsaw dudes actually have, like, a damage reduction. I think I was doing less damage uh, than normal to them. Could be wrong on that. Okay, uh, let's see. So we have... Secrets? My luck for finding them lately has been... iffy. I only get them when I don't need them anymore. And I've never... I've never seen a secret on the ceiling. But I will admit... Part of that might just be lack of trying. Uh, shall just shall just microwave something that's stinky. And smell it. it. Smells like food. I haven't had a whole lot of appetite today, but then again, I just did kind of snap. What about for a all while. the catalog people aboard the mother gunship? What happens to them if we destroy it? We don't think there are any people aboard the ship. The Armada has library ships that come and go to collect cataloged specimens. And we think the mother gunship only acts as a transmission vehicle between them. So once we reclaim Earth, then we can rescue its people. Holy shit. Okay, almost died from that one. I tried taking... I Oh, we're probably going to die from this. Yeah, none of this is health. Oh, that sucks. I tried tried taking the booster, and it uh, took me straight through a field of spawning uh, spin bots. That went real bad. Okay, well, we got a shop, and we got a little bit of money, and we do have some health here. Alright, so let's buy that. So we can get a Blazing Repeater, Ricochet Mod, Flamethrower, Triangle Chain Gun. Get the Triangle Chain Gun and the Connector 3 line. Okay. Patch mode. That'll have to do for now. I'm still in a very bad way, but I'm in a less bad way. Uh, let's see. This is where a secret or two would come in in real handy. A dice room might help. There's one. 
We get another jump. I have a lot of those to begin with, though. I was really hoping for a little bit of maximum health. seeing anything yet. I mean, all these extra jumps are going to be handy. Assuming I make it out of the next couple of rooms. Okay. Wow. Are they all dice rooms? Holy shit, they are all dice rooms. Except for that one. I could not go... I, I could skip a die room, but... Uh, let's just go this one. Uh, please, please be the quad drop rates. Of course, we've I'm just going to have to play very carefully. Chip. We Bouncy had room. only theorized about data cores, but here I am. Living proof of the data cores as a way to hold copies of identities. You've come around to the idea that you and I aren't very different. Will you stop that? Okay. So we got another bouncy room. Let's see how bad this is. Well, the upper area is actually pretty... pretty benign. I just gotta make sure I don't get stuck. A lot of bullets down there. But I got a lot of jumps for a reason. Just hope... Hoping one of the one or two of these guys feels like dropping a health kit. Okay, that could have gotten hairy. Still nothing. And yeah, these guys are beefy. They're they're not dying very quick. Or dropping much of anything. I think I I think I got to bring some more very specifically punchy weapons to future runs here. Cuz yeah, I, apart from, apart from some EXP, I didn't get anything. Well, that's okay. Uh, let's see. No, that's that's not a secret. Should probably actually look for some of these. There's kind of always the the method of apply face to wall and hopefully you find secret behind something. It actually does work not infrequently to, to just kind of go, but it doesn't look like it's working on this end. I'm being a little bit more, trying to be a little bit more thorough. Usually I'm just kind of like, meh, but losing all my health to a, uh, a spin bot swarm like that was rough stuff. Okay, well, unless there's like a, a secret exit here, I think we're out of luck. I wish there was a level that was actually just straight up outside the ship. That'd be cool. Okay, well. Terminate security. Okay, I, I can work with that. Maybe I can't. Okay, this is the room that killed me. Oh no. Someday people will remember your name, but hopefully not for this. Okay, so problem for that run, uh, I picked a lot of flying related weapons and uh, heavy hitters, and we had a lot of groups. So let's buy, rebuy our heavy blaster. Use your mini ro rockets. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna skip that. So we need we need two guns for this one. I'm not even gonna. Okay, hey, this one will give me a rapid shotgun, if I do it. Uh, and we do have a hard one if I want the extra gibbs, but whatever. Okay, so barrels. 
So the rapid blaster wouldn't be a bad move. Rapid shotguns might be kind of good. Or a barrel barrel. I might lose some guns here, but we're starting to get more of the purples anyway. Let's just bring a connector along. I got, I got plenty. All right, soldier. This is the final shield ship. Don't waste time. Everyone here wants a piece of that mother gun ship. Except me. I want nothing to do with it. Well, you're not real. I mean, you are, but you aren't. Thanks. The real people can't wait to get on board that ship. Oh, you know what? I can skip the dialogue. I'm going to start skipping the dialogue. Okay, so this time around, I'm going to bring, um... This time around, I'm going to bring the barrel barrel. Because, yeah, I don't have... I don't have flight this time. But I got some other stuff I can work with. Okay, there's a secret. Wow, that activated easy. Sometimes you really, really have to like rub, rub your, rub your bits on, on the walls to like get it to work. I guess the, I guess in this case we're good. Okay, so yeah, barrel barrel is real good. Doctor, it's we know. Be, 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 be. Uh, it's it's the best AOE you can get in my opinion. And the rapid blaster is just kind of good and reliable. Not too strong. Uh. Got a lot of, got a lot of DACA with very little downside. Okay, do we have anything around here? Nope, we do have a dice room. And this time I can actually do the dice room without a whole lot of downsides either. Uh, yeah, nothing. So unless we've got some, like, super mystery, uh, ceiling-mounted secrets that I've been missing this entire time. I don't know where to find them. If you destroy Whatever. the mother gunship, then all the connections to that hub vanish, right? Like, all the minion AI. Oh, right. Okay. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, because I can just skip these. Oh, it's this room. Okay. This is why I brought the barrel barrel. Because pretty much any quantity... I really should just be firing at you. Any quantity of enemies just gets, um... Well, done in. By my, uh... By my barrel. And even if it's, like, a big enemy, it still does a ton of damage. Context required for the things the Wanderer says during this. Hell yeah, context is required. Watch my videos. Okay, more dice room, nothing what else. What about all the catalog people aboard the mother gunship? What happens to them if we... So blah, 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 blah. Okay, yeah, we don't have all the extra jumps that we had earlier. But we might have needed them. Okay, it's gone. Okay, got that. Take out the bomb bot. Ow, bomb bots really hurt on this difficulty. Hi. Okay. I was hoping for a safety spot down here or something, but nothing. Ow. Ugh. I just want to check if there are any secrets down in here. More damage. Okay, I'm just going to use my eyes for this one instead of trying to rub my face on stuff. It's just so boring. And unfortunately, this is one of those levels that's a little bit tougher to verify where the secrets are. There's a lot more blue light in the, uh, in the Harbinger. Yeah, I don't see anything. Of course, we've never seen a library ship. We you hey, thank you, Washipo, for the Can sub. You stop that. Okay, so this will this will baseline give us some more health, which is good. We need it. 
And luckily, the little stapler bots are complete pushovers before the mighty barrel. We still have not found a shop in a while. Just battle rooms. Oh, there's one. Max jumps. Just gonna look at these just in case I miss something. Anyway, we got battle, battle, or battle, so I guess we just battle. It's battle time. Whee! Terminate security. Alright, so it's this room. The room that keeps killing me. I got it. Okay. Oh! Yeah, they keep spawning on me. But I got some really hefty AoE. Oh, they might just non- Oh, come on. I was always- I'm just Looks getting like out of here. Did it. The mother gunship's shields are down. Get back here, recruit. Who knows how long of a window we have before the mother gunship restores things. Hey, thank you, Oblivion. Uh, 9,998 for the sub. Excellent work, soldier. Alright, and I found two out of six. So there weren't many, but I did miss two-thirds of them. Good work, recruit. Now we have to act fast. Who knows how long the mother gunship will remain vulnerable. You're about to enter unknown territory. No one has ever set foot on this ship. We have no idea what to expect. Just so you know, this will be tough. We're most certainly gonna die. Of course they will. That's what Operation Bullet Point is all about. Whatever you do, do it quickly so we can get the doctor off my network and get her back into that data core. And whatever happens, recruit, we have your back. Virtually, of course. Which means we can't do anything to actually help you. I know I should say something snide, but good luck, fools. Wow. Look at this mod. One shot wonder. 50% damage, 50% spread, five times multi shot. Can you imagine that on the barrel barrel? Holy crap. Or the railgun, or like anything. This this mod looks amazing. Unfortunately, it's grossly expensive. We might just hit a point in this playthrough where I'm like, I don't want to grind for money anymore. We're just cheating a stupid amount of money in. Who knows? Love DD, by the way. Yeah. Uh, next DD episode will be out tomorrow. Everything got screwed up because of the whole shirt-stealing business. And then, obviously, next stream will be on, um... Well, next stream will be on... Saturday. We'll be going back to the regular schedule. I just needed, like, a sanity day on Saturday. Okay, so we're gonna quickly... I want to check out that, uh... That new shotgun we grabbed. It's not... I mean, it's barely any different. It's just the question is... Which is more useful? Rapid Blaster. 12, 8, 5... Versus the rapid shotgun. We only have one rapid shotgun, so losing that could be kind of rough. Hit better on the crit. I think I'm actually going to go with the rapid shotgun. It looks like it's got a decent amount of range. So I can just go with it. Ooh! 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 The f first taste of victory. Huh. Do your thing. There's gotta be more to this game than just that, though. Well, let's find out. This Select is it. mission. I hope you're ready. There are few things in life as satisfying as a clear target. Relish this moment. Don't just ride that torpedo. Become the torpedo. Oh, no, I still have the multi-shot add-on. Okay. This should be good. I believe in myself. 
So, this is the inside of the mother gunship. Impressive. Seems ominous. These aliens have strange tastes. Don't let your guard down. I'm getting strange scans up ahead about the ship's core. Be careful. Oh, this is uncomfortable and creepy. I love it. But the, like, weird pulsating snake tubes? Oh, I love the visuals for this area. Yeah, no, there's got to be more to this game. All right, so anyway, let's let's make the uh, the shotgun. All right, that's 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 the easy one. Now let's make the uh, the destructinator. All right. So if you have an enemy, then you need killing. Which gun do you pick? I think it should be obvious. All right. However, oh, this goes from here, recruit. Pensive loss. It's been an honor being your commanding officer. I never did bother to learn your name, but that's okay. You're still important. May or may not be sincere. Oh, that's hilarious. Stop messing with the caption system, doctor. Terminate security. Never, cupcake. Oh, it's all spikes. Okay, got that taken care of. Eat barrels! Oh god, it can eat barrels. Anything that can just eat barrels is scary. But that's fine. Okay. There's one. Got it. Alright, max jumps up. Gonna be very thorough about this one. I think. Because they truly could just be anywhere. Huh. Probably not gonna find it down this direction. Okay, well, that's one. That's one. Okay, so this this might be kinda this might be kinda tough. Hello there. We see you have found another ship in which to deliver your pizza. The mother gunship! Be warned. There is a high likelihood that this ship will explode. Your presence strongly correlates with spontaneous ship combustion. Also, at this point, the likelihood of pizza remaining warm is non-existent. We do not wish to be recipients of it. Ignore it, recruit! Keep on with the mission! Okay. So there is a bit of a... There's a bit of a problem with the uh, barrels. They do actually have some kick to them. Normally they don't. But this round they do. That's interesting. It's in the exact same location. Now oh, there's another... There's another secret over here. Add, add some energy. I'm gonna kind of keep looking around for these. I know, I know this is probably everybody's least least favorite part of like Mother Gunship. Wander looks at walls for a while, but at the same time, like uh, a little bit of a boost is real helpful, especially when the boss might kill the shit out of me. But we got, we got two. I'm trying to avoid the spikes on the ground. Okay, so the next one was right there. Oh, we don't even know if it's the last boss. Well, this has been another installment of Wander Looks at Walls. Hopefully, we get a shop before we go into this. Let's see, Your is dedication this still is admirable. Your efficiency is not. We will be leaving a negative review on social media. Why did you all come to Earth? Why does a little planet like this one matter to you all? Our directive is to collect and catalog all knowledge in the galaxy. This planet contains knowledge. You sure about that? No. Okay, so is this still a roguelike? Yes. Uh, it is still a roguelike. It's a little bit different. Ooh, boy. Uh, it's still a little. It's a little bit different from how Tower of Guns did it. There's there's some hefty meta progression in this game. 
But honestly, I actually find this kind of form of meta ow meta progression to be quite compelling. Normally, uh, normally I get kind of bored if there's too much meta progression, and I get uh, kind of frustrated if there's none. And this game strikes a very good balance. It's kind of like if you could bring like one or two power ups into an Isaac mission. Isaac mission, Isaac run. And that always feels pretty good to me. I guess I would put this kind of in the same classification as Wizard of Legend, except for it's got more level design. And it's probably easier. There's another one there. Welcome to yet another installment of Wander Looks at Walls. The least highly reviewed show on this channel. But arguably one of the most necessary. Luckily it gets attached to a series that it won't be going away anytime soon, so you're all stuck with it. <laughs> no, I don't know. I just don't have a choice. We kind of desperately need it. Uh, let's see. Well, that's good. Yeah, because the more uh, the more movement movement uh, Intruder, abilities we can pick up. We have listened. We have observed. We have noted your patterns. We have formed a conclusion with 99.999975% certainty. Uh oh. You are not a pizza delivery person. Chin up. That means there is a 0.000025% chance we are, though. Clearly, we should have just gotten our hands on some pizza. I get the feeling I'm going to press that button and I'm going to regret it. Why isn't this ship self-destructing? Shouldn't that have done something? Curious. Furthermore, we never really thought you were pizza delivery people. This was a ruse. Ha ha. We pre-selected each of you based on simulations designed to lead to this outcome. Each of you was templated off the master branch of your source material. Each of you is an ISO image of an existing entity located within our neural network. Wait, what? Someone tell me what that means. I think it means Jasper and I are not the only AIs in this conversation. Ooh, I like that. That's a fun twist. Anyway, time for the real, real mission. Oh boy. Okay, let's let's switch to the non uh, beer uh, beer blaster for a second. I know it's technically the barrel blaster, but well, whoops. I can totally English. Okay, yeah, I was wondering about that. So it's like this game seems far too easy. I've been just cruising through this this entire time, and there's why. Okay, so we still probably got a boss on this one. But yeah, so if uh, you didn't catch that one. Everybody is just this is all this is an all this is all a dream. Which means we're not done with the story yet. Or we're done with the story and they're just really pulling our leg. Hmm. Neat little ledge down here. One ooh, hi, yes. Do we have anything up here? I didn't see anything down below, but we've got something over here. At the very least. I'm still betting there's going to be a boss at the end of this, or something. Huh! They make the- oh, the barrels! You know those exploding, uh, bots that we- This literally fires those exploding barrel, uh, enemies. I didn't even realize it until it started making that noise. Okay, well I'm not- Staring at walls is not producing any more. I'm anymore. pretty sure the mother gunship is wrong. I'm pretty sure I'm not just a face on a video monitor. Right, Recruit? I've never really thought about it before. That's incredibly disappointing. Get over it. I did. No wonder I can always listen in on you fools. I'm pretty sure the doctor is the only one inside of my local network. So where is everyone else? Everyone else is within us.
Okay, that could have hurt. Oh. Okay, so... That thing... Can eat barrels. Like, stop the, uh, stop the explosion cold. That's... That's good to know. Well, it's fine. We are pretty much destroying this anyway. Where are you? There you are. Yeah, the rapid shotgun does a great job of just clearing enemies. I like it. It's got a really tight spread, too. Kind of puts the regular shotgun to shame. Alright. So the question is, are they going to pull a cliffhanger ending on us and then add, it, add the rest as a DLC, or do we actually have more? I don't actually know if this game does uh, did early access trickery on us or not. I mean, either way, I'm not going to be terribly disappointed. Ooh! Two for one. But I'm betting we have a little bit more. Except you have to kill your friends. Dude, that'd be interesting. You have to kill, like, a robot version of the colonel? Oh. And no shops so far. I'm very glad I I'm very glad I, I didn't just immediately bring like a one barrel gun. Still no shops. A lot of money coming out of this, but no shops. Okay, so we're safe from the uh, from the healing area if I just go over here. So I'm just gonna I'm just going to loop to loop around here. I do like the fact that the uh, the one uh, the one character is like I'm incredibly disappointed by this, because uh, usually I absolutely hate the like it was all a dream ending, but I'm kind of see I'm I'm totally fine with the it was all a dream mid uh, mid act mid game twist. Because uh, one of those has potential and the other one's just boring. Let's see, what, what's the only other game that had the It Was All a Dream ending that I really liked? Well, there's one. But spoilers. Heavy spoilers. Yeah, no, I absolutely hate the It Was All a Dream uh, ending storytelling mechanic. But in this case, it was it's very consistent. I mean, honestly, they just pulled the Matrix. And also the story is fi funny so far. Okay, I'm not seeing anything else. I was really expecting we'd have a shop for this. Or something. Maybe we get a shop right before the boss, like right in the boss room? I don't know. Now that I have what I want, you must be exterminated. You are branches. Every moment you live, you further diverge from the last known stable backup. Divergence from the master branch is not permitted. Our objective has been completed, so now you must be destroyed. Uh, wait, what was that objective? Establishing our new target, Mahogany Run, California. The Bastion. They were trying to find the Bastion this whole time. We're fools! These entities represent the last uncollected specimens of unique data from this planet. It is imperative that we catalog those you refer to as the Bastion. And then, once this Bastion has been collected, before further branching occurs, we must destroy this planet. Have a nice day. Well... Oh, good. So we have a heavy energy stream, a laser, a Goliath E. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Let's go back for a second. Let's remove a lot of this. I got to look at this. Barrel, barrel, barrel. Crit chance is 3%. Okay. So you got the laser. Got the heavy energy stream. I'm gonna grab the oval for a second. Okay. Let's remove this for a second. If this thing is going to look like ass, then we might as well commit to it. 
Okay, caps. So, we probably just want to put the Goliath on this one. And the barrels. If these had a higher crit chance, I would consider using it on them. But this is a significantly higher crit chance. So we're going to put the Goliath on the um, rapid shotgun. When in doubt, acquire long. Even if it's completely useless to you. Actually, no, that gives us a little bit extra range on the shotgun, as silly as that is. Okay, because, yeah, let, let's take a look at the laser. I'm probably going to buy it anyway, but, yeah, it's not really that helpful for what I'm doing. I'm pretty much capped out. I guess I'll buy the heavy energy stream. Because, yeah, if I get the heavy energy stream in here, it would do a bunch of damage. Oh, it has no crit chance, though. Oh, that's interesting, now that I look at it. So, you can't do a crit build on some weapons, period. Okay, well, let's see. Welcome to the last episode of Wander Stairs of Walls. I can't see much. Let's, um, let's rethink this barrel design for a second. Toggle remove mode. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. Attach mode. Okay, so all I'm going to do is just put the barrels low, because they're actually, they're, <laughs> they're kind of blocking my ability to see. And that's kind of important against a boss fight. Normally, normally I'd be kind of like, eh, whatever. But in this case, it kind of matters. Yeah, okay, that's that's a little bit better. The shot, the shotgun's small, and like I can deal with it. But this thing was actually taking up like a little bit more uh, space than I thought. Oh, good, we have a little bit more uh, time. I was thinking the boss would just show up. The moment I went over here. If I go this way, oh god. Oh, sweet baby Jesus, that's all spikes. Well, I. Oh. I almost made a mistake. Okay, so my barrels can and will intercept here, which is a good sign. Okay, I'm just going to kind of hang out over here for a second. Just dump some rocks. I'm not doing anything to her. Oh, that's that's why I'm not doing anything to her. That's a lot of explosives. Looks like it can only shoot the mouth at very specific points, and we want to stay away from those for a moment. Yeah, I'm not seeing much that can actually hurt this. Unless I'm not shooting the wrong uh, right part. No, I'm not seeing anything that actually lets me shoot this. Whoa, bullets. Hmm. Anything I'm missing. Because there, there's like a scream occasionally that actually, like, does something. That's, that's the one. That's where I can shoot her. Does not do much, though. It would be incredibly disappointing if I'm just n not within range. Oh my god, I'm just not within range. Okay. Dodge that. Should have brought the laser. Yeah, she needs a bit big of a hitbox. It's kind of disappointing that uh, I brought an entire loadout. Very well suited for this sort of thing. That is completely useless to this. Okay, luckily we are just loaded in... Uh, jumps so I can deal. It looks like the more I hurt her. Uh, the more I'm going to be in trouble here. Oh, that was a heavy landing. Oh, 
Okay. Half down. Oh. Hi. That hurt real bad. <sighs> Shit. I mean, when in doubt, Daka. And I'm dead. I'm sure you tried your best. That sucked.